She wants answers. A year has passed since her son's murder and still no arrest. And tonight, a mother pleading for the police to step up their search for answers. The night team's Patty Santos reports. How would you feel if they would have killed your son? That's the question Magdalena Martinez has made to San Antonio police investigators over the phone, trying to understand why her son's case is still unsolved. This has changed my life. It's been a tragedy. The wheelchair-bound mother says her son was part of her caretaking team. The 28-year-old left behind three children under six years old, the youngest not even born when he died. He was a loving son. He was a, he loved his sister, he loved his nephews. San Antonio police are looking for the driver of this black four-door sedan. Witnesses told police Mendoza was sitting in his car at the light on General McMullen in El Paso on March 25, 2022, around 7 p.m. when he was shot. A year has passed and still no answers or an arrest in his murder. Please turn yourself in. Why were you a coward? Why did you kill them the way you killed them? To mark the sorrowful occasion, friends gathered for a vigil over the weekend. If you saw anything, if you hear anything, if you know anything about this case about my son, please speak up. Crime Stoppers is offering a $5,000 reward. Patty Santos, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.